So I'm officially ready to go on my first delivery trip with my board. Here it is, all charged up with my remote. And yeah. So first thing we gotta do is turn on the board. I'm clicking here. That's turned on. Turn on the remote. And it vibrates to show it's paired up. Now you can see batteries are completely full in mode 3. I've gone 65 kilometers so far since yesterday. Um, let's go. Okay, so the first order I already picked up is in my bag right now from Subway. Now we're gonna go. Okay. So I just finished my first delivery with Subway and it wasn't that great because I've been riding on this road. You see like over there? It's just all pavement and it's like boom 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 boom. You really feel in the board. Um but that's what are you gonna do? Like there's no other way. Okay, so I'm back home now and I did 9.1 kilometers and the battery is like more than maybe 60% drained. And I only have one delivery, <laughs> just like three dollars from Subway. But it's so fun man. I just kept riding, like I, I didn't wait for the delivery to come through and um, yeah so now I'm back home, I might take a little break and then go out again when I get another order and like this is like totally non-feasible with the, um, with the bike because with the bike I like, I'm tired, I don't want to ride back home, take a break but with this thing it's just so fun. Alright, so this might not be so interesting because it's like happening in real time so I, I figured I'd do a voiceover uh, just to kind of talk about what's going on here. Um, basically when you deliver Uber, you get an order, you accept it, you go to the restaurant, show the restaurant your order code, they'll give you the order and then you gotta pack it up somehow. And uh, since I'm on a skateboard, it's kind of hard to carry it so I actually have this insulated bag that I got from DoorDash um, and then I pack it up in my bag that way because um, you want don't want the food to get cold by the time you get to the customer's place but yeah you pack it up um, I like this bag that I have it's quite big and then also like if I'm delivering something like a sushi or something I can just carry the red bag as opposed to uh, putting stuff inside like upside down and having food spill Okay, pick up a Popeye complete, let's go. So we just finished another delivery, uh, went at 10 kilometers there and back. And now I have about 60% battery life. So I say the range is probably 20 kilometers. Um, I did a delivery today with Subway and that was quite good. We're in about 8 kilometers, we'll see how much tips we get. But basically, I had this board now for 2 days, and I've gone 130 kilometers on it. So that kind of tells you like, how, fun, how much fun it is. And one of the days I actually went camping, but I still use it. I actually came in really clutch at camping because it was so hard to go from campsite to campsite. And uh, what I did is like, I used this to get to the beach, and it was like,
And I'm almost home. That was fun. Okay, so I just did three deliveries this morning. And this is what the spot says. I've traveled 22.7 kilometers. And right now I still have one bar of battery left. But I think it's getting down there. So the range is probably around 22, 23. And there was a lot of hills on this climb today. Okay, so um, by now, hopefully you're kind of interested in uh, delivering Uber. And if so, great. I will have my uh, referral link right here. Um, so you can use that link to sign up and uh, I get a bonus when you complete 50 deliveries and for your 50 deliveries you're guaranteed a minimum amount of money to be paid um, and if you're not paid that amount of money the Uber will top you up. Uh, the amount depends from jurisdiction to jurisdiction but I think in Toronto is for 50 trips you're guaranteed $200. Um, you probably will go over that with tips and everything but if not the Uber will top you up. I think that's the bonus. Uh, right now as of this recording date but uh, yeah when you click the link it will tell you what the bonus in your jurisdiction is so I got my board in September and I've just been going out when I have free time again I have a full-time job so I'm not like going out every day um, all the time but basically whenever I have one or two hours like after work um, sometimes on the weekends so this is how much I made in September so you got 90 140 160 40 so I don't know, this is probably about 300, 400, 450, about that. And then if we look at the next one in October, um, in October, again, this is how much I made. Uh, that's about 300, 370, 370 plus 100. So, 500, about 500 in October, and then next in November, I already got to erase all this stuff. Here we go. In November, also about uh, this amount. So that's 100, 200, plus 300, that's about, about 550, 600. Um, so basically like the board has already paid for itself because I paid 750 Canadian for it. Um, so it's such a good investment naturally and it's so fun just riding my board. Yeah, so highly recommended if you want to do that.